I have been in this workshop for the past three days. Uh, my coming here is mainly because we realize that um, the RISE technologies can also be communicated with the farmers using radio and other ICTs that Farm Radio has already been using. As a result of that, we want to work in Ghana, Mali and Benin. So my presence here has been to share how the various countries can use radio, uh, how best they can use it to ensure that they achieve the best out of the use of radio. With this training, what I notice is that um, everybody has, an eye, uh, has a lot of passion to see to it that the dissemination of technology goes on very well in their country. And this was uh, shown by the level of participation throughout the whole three days. There hasn't been any day that um, we will not learn something new uh, from uh, the platform, the RISE platform that um, we were introduced to, uh, and the video technology. Um, it was very, very lively received. We can see that um, it is already uh, starting in Ghana, and the examples that we saw, uh, everybody was interested in using uh, something like that in their country. I believe um, the ICAF is a very good forum for knowledge exchange and also share um, uh, learning new ideas that can help improve upon dissemination in our various countries. It is important that everyone knows what happens in each pole and that the poles can exchange between them and exchange with the exterior. So it is a process that allows to share the information the most largely possible information le plus largement possible. Et cet atelier nous a permis donc de voir un peu le, tout l'intérêt que nous avons à, à, à faciliter cela. Donc toute notre responsabilité dans le dispositif est assez, assez donc importante. I'm actually working on the effectiveness of different uh, communication tools in adoption of agricultural innovations, in particular adoption of rice innovations. So, and I won a scholarship, an Africa Rice Scholarship, and that is the reason I'm here today. That uh, it has been an amazing experience because for now I was exposed to what an e-hub is, how we can go back home using the using local situation to be able to update what is already there in the e-hub, and how we will be updating it time to time. That is one. Then the other. For also actually know the technologies that we could use to upscale what is happening in this in the hub because we are like information bridges we are supposed to facilitate information exchange among the different uh, tax forces in the in the hub effectivement ce pro, eh, cet atelier m'a beaucoup appris cet atelier m'a permis de voir quels outils sont efficaces pour porter l'information au niveau local. Donc à, à travers cet atelier, nous avons vu les différentes plateformes du hub des différents pays qui étaient en avance par rapport à notre pays avec lesquels on a eu à échanger beaucoup. Et l'expérience de certains pays comme le Mali, la Côte d'Ivoire et le Sénégal nous a été très très utile. Et nous sommes là euh, depuis trois jours pour partager un peu les expériences et pour voir un, euh, comment animer cette plateforme électronique qui doit permettre de mettre en valeur tout ce que les chercheurs font au niveau de chaque pôle et également tous les intervenants au niveau des pôles de développement risicole. En Côte d'Ivoire, nous avons deux pôles. Nous avons le pôle de Gagnoua et le pôle de Mans. Le pôle de Gagnoua qui travaille essentiellement sur le riz irrigué et le pôle de Mans qui travaille sur le riz pluvial. Donc nous, en tant que IKF, nous sommes un facilitateur pour permettre aux, à tous les partenaires de partager toute l'information qui sera développée et diffusée au sein de tous les hubs et aussi permettre à tous les partenaires d'avoir l'information indispensable pour le développement risicole de la Côte d'Ivoire. From all that uh, we, we went through, I've really appreciated the effort of uh, Africa Rice, 
bringing together the participating countries so we can share information on the RISE platform. Now, here um, I also wish to express my concern for the, uh, the way participants comporting themselves and open up so we could share information among ourselves. And we all started building the strong relations or linkages among participating countries so we can um, communicate among ourselves about issues and our, some of our common problems and other issues that may crop up on the hop. Again, we've also had the opportunity to share with other uh, subject matter specialists say how we can adapt some of the methodologies on our e-hop to facilitate the, the hop activities. Uh, donc, nous devons um, vulgariser toutes les informations um, sur les pôles rizicoles. Autrement dit, et, euh, faire euh, échanger avec les producteurs Euh, les, 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 les paysans, hein, les chercheurs pour mieux véhiculer et, et les informations sur les pôles rizicoles. This e-hub is going to help Nigeria at large in the rice sector in propagating the innovation of how they can plant more seeds and how they can get more resources out of the seed market. And this innovation about radio is going to do a lot in telling farmer where to get the particular seed of particular variety per location that they need, as well as help the seed companies in Nigeria to improve. Not neglecting the extension agents, make their work more efficient.